Hello, this is Richard Jacobs with the Finding Genius podcast, part of the Finding Genius Foundation. I have Giulio Passanetti. He's a professor of neurology at the Icon School of Medicine, Mount Sinai in New York. And we're going to talk about Alzheimer's disease and uh, his work in it. So, Giulio, thank you for coming. My pleasure. Yeah. Well, tell me about your work. Is it clinical? Is it just research? Is it a mixture? Let me just uh, give you a brief uh, introduction of who I am and, uh, and the historical perspective of uh, where I'm coming from and the reason why I get into this kind of research and then uh, why I think that okay. uh, okay. indeed, uh, sorry, to your question, you know, we are going to move on more into the translational study and potential some kind of clinical application based on uh, several kind of studies that, that we have been doing you know, always in collaboration as well as many other different major research center that based on preclinical work. So for the, my, my historical perspective has been always to study the mechanism uh, of uh, molecular aging. I got my PhD part in Milan uh, and as well as a University of Southern California. My mentor was Cali Finch. Yes, Cali Finch. Uh, I still as a good friend, still uh, actually very active uh, at USC. And I, we consider him as actually the father of neurobiology of aging. So Understanding the mechanism of uh, aging in some way as uh, the major risk factor of uh, almost a neurodegenerative disorder that we call age-related neurodegenerative disorder has been a fundamental part of also understanding the mechanism associated to the onset of Alzheimer's disease. So in the last 30 years, most, most of my work has been uh, dedicated primarily to try to understand uh, the mechanism, mechanism that you can study definitely in an experimental model. But the most important thing is actually to try to get the best of this mechanism, try to translate them into the human, and try to understand that through this kind of translational application with different kind of mechanism that are also mechanisms associated with funding from NIH and as well as philanthropy, to try to target and identify what is actually in the giant this jargon is called the target engagement of a specific drugs after you understand the mechanism and try from there to develop